Hello everyone, please welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you E90 and the, it's a 328i BMW and I'm going to replace the radiator hose and I will show you how it's easy you can do it. The reason I'm replacing the hose as you can see it's just broke off. This is the replacement hose as you can see broken off right here. The first thing we're going to do remove the air dirt assembly two bolts right here which requires 10 millimeters and once these are removed so you loosen the clamp so. now we're going to lift it up disconnect the electrical in order to disconnect you need to lift and then pull the connector off. so uh, as you can see this is the hose is broken off and uh, also you see I have a leakage uh, oil that I'm going to show you in a different video how we're going to fix it so we're going to pop open these one on this side uh, and one on this side and there is a one at the bottom just like that and that that hose will come down so we're going to pry the hole as you can see these holes are sticking there for a long time so use a screwdriver so that's how you remove the hose and uh, be careful when you're removing it since they are sitting there for a long period of time it will require some patience and some force i'm going to open uh, this hose and i'm going to use the original existing one this is the only piece we need to replace it this is the hose which we're going to put it in so you just bend it and it will slide out it will slide in and then you put the clamp back and on this side just like that and this is the hose we're going to place it on top of it and then tighten and don't over tight so once it's fully tight so now we're going to put the bottom hose and when you pull it up as you hear the click and that locks in and this is the extra hose keep it in safe place next time if you need to use it you can always use it so this is the hose which connects to the reservoir on this end so now we're going to place it back in a reverse order we're going to put this one into the hose and we're going to put that in once the hose is fully slid in, now we're going to tighten the clamp. So make sure it's fully tightened. And then we're going to plug in the electrical clamp. Now we're going to put these two 10 millimeter bolt. After replacing the hose, as you've seen, it was a broken one. And we're going to make sure that we're going to top off the reservoir with the colon and that's how it's easy and simple you can replace upper radiator hose if it's broken so if you found this video to be helpful like always like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and have a good day bye bye